Hi, hello, I am the CyberWave Guru. Thank you for watching. So I've got a cutting board here, sanding it, and I got some detailed parts over here that I need to sand. So I bought a detailed sander from Harbor Freight. I'm gonna unbox it, show you all the parts. So this is the variable speed oscillating sander by Harbor Freight. It was very inexpensive. I wanna say it was like $23 US. I don't use these very often. I figure, you know, even if it craps out after a little bit, it should be fine, so let's unbox it and see what's inside. Alright, we have the little oscillating cutting blade uh, to cut things off. We have uh, a straight blade. I don't know, I guess that's to scrape things. Hard to tell. Allen wrench. Got a nut and a washer. Or should I say a bolt and a washer? Got some sanding pads here, 60 grit, 80 grit. And the adhesive, I'm oh, sorry, the uh, uh, loop and hook backing, which I'm assuming gets screwed onto this guy. So there you go, that's the assembly. I'm guessing this knot is only to be used with these guys, so I will uh, put those in a uh, bag separate. Put the sanding pad on here. Okay, the sanding pad's not really an exact fit, but but should work for our purposes. So we're gonna. Undo the twist tie here. Plug it in. See what happens. Air protection. All right, so that is the unboxing and first use of the Harbor Freight Variable Speed Oscillating Multifunction Power Tool. So that is this guy right here. Now, uh, my initial use here, I gotta tell you, it's, it's quite heavy, it's bulky. I got little teeny hands, it's hard to wrap around. But I will tell you, it does a good job getting in the corners, does a great job. Uh, smoothing out things that are very, very small. I had uh, obviously troubles using the random orbit sander here, which is uh, five inches, like getting in this bowl, for example. Uh, I could, you know, get a little bit of the flat bottom, but not any of the quarters. And then certainly with something like the handle, I couldn't use the, end, the random orbit sander at all to do that. So this tool works pretty well for the price point. You know, it's worth it. Uh, like I said, I'll continue using it if it does not perform well in the future or if it dies prematurely. I'm sure to let everyone know, but uh, certainly compared to some of the other price points, it seems to do its job and do it well. So, all right, that's it. I hope you liked the video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for making it this far. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. Ring the bell to be notified of new content. That's very important these days. Be inspired. Thanks everyone. And don't forget. <clears throat> what else do I say? I don't remember. All right. And